Hey everybody, welcome back to a new episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. In the last episode we got to the Snowhead's Temple and here we are getting our first gay fairy. These are green gay fairies. Thank you. Okay, so we got our first gay fairy right up here and I'm wearing the Lands of Truth. I have no reason why I did that, but... Well, we are in the second dungeon of the game, so going to try to fix this in one day because then I can do stuff that I wanted to do a long time ago but we cannot do that because we are not at that point yet so but everybody wants to have that so oh fun fact as Goron Link yes you can climb ladder it's not like uh, Bowser's inside story that uh, Bowser uh, I thought it was in Bowser's inside story that Bowser cannot climb ladder so oh we're in Paper Mario sorry it was Super Paper Mario that he cannot climb on ladders Okay, what we want to do is, we want to roll here. Yes, there was another gay fairy right here, but we cannot get that right now. Please do not freeze me! I didn't get enough momentum. Owie. <sighs> yeah, Gorons apparently can walk through lava. I have no idea why, but in Twilight Princess they didn't... They did use it a lot, so... Uh, well, actually he's burning his ass, so apparently... They will take damage if you take too long on the lava, I have no idea, but... Uh, and I know you can hear that sound a lot of the phone. I'm not really sure if you can hear it, but it's kind of loud, so maybe you can hear it, I'm not sure, but... Let's just hope that we cannot hear it. Okay, now. Spinning roll attack. With enough momentum this time. Oh, I missed! <sighs> Give me a sec. Go run. Oh, apparently not. Thank you very much, I'm alive. Really appreciate that. Anyway, we can see another gay fairy right up there. I'm not sure if I can hit that one, but that would be nice if we can shoot that gay fairy, because then we already have two gay fairies. As you 20 girls yawning. Okay. And we got our second stray fairy, gay fairy. Oh, the return of the gay fairies. Uh, anyway, we can destroy these guys if we want. Without any reason, because we cannot uh, destroy that chunk of ice there, so... Anyway, what was behind this door? I totally forgot. Let's see. Um... Oh, yeah, this is the main room, right over here. This is the central room that we're going to see a lot. So, if you want to see this room a lot, then stick tuned to this let's play a lot so but anyway i thought that we cannot do anything here well we can go here that will bring us downwards if i'm not mistaken because downwards are some stuff that we can do uh for example you will see that there is some grass here that you can use to reveal on bombs and arrows uh this grass will always Grow back, so if you are running out of magic or anything, uh, you don't have to worry about the thing. Um, this switch will be used later on. Oh, I actually wanted to add that one in the bottle. Uh, there's a very big switch, oversized switch, right over there, and we want to use that switch. If I'm not mistaken, we get another gay fairy. Chest will appear, take some time. I love it actually how the chest is just appearing in the lava and it's not burning or anything. That that chest must be made of the strongest material in What? I was just getting hit while the stray fairy was popping out of there just to get out of there. Okay, well anyway we have three stray fairies at this moment, so that's a good thing, and for the rest we cannot do anything down here yet. So, there was another door, and I think that we're just going to check out what that door is taking us, so... Uh, let's see... This door brings us up here, where we can push and pull this thing! Okay, this thing will become important later on in this dungeon, so... I really recommend that if you are here, that you're just going to use it. Uh, and place it at the right spot already because it's going to be necessary. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to push this forward and uh, we're not going to have a moment of silence here. And Zip20 girls mocking me again. A lot. 
Yeah, I lost. I know. I watched too many Jeff Tower. I know. Anyway, you can see these platforms up here. You can see a door up there, and if you want to make this jump later on, you just want to make sure that you are having this one standing right over there. Also, a new chest will appear that will be... Uh, uh, yeah, that, yeah, you can actually can, uh, collect that one later. Um, yeah, I'm just going to spoil that. It's going to contain a stray fairy, so... Hello. Anyway, in this chest over here, that looks gold and is not inside of lava... We will find a small key in ZB20 Girls mocking me. A lot. Okay, enough of the lot jokes. Okay, if I was thinking it was a stray fairy up there or not. Nope. It's in another room. Your gay fairy is in another castle. Anyway, about that door right over there, we cannot enter that because there is a chunk of ice in it. Again. So, that was all that we can do. So, we're going backwards to the first room because there was a locked door and now we have a key. We can probably see what's going to be inside. Or we're going to check out what's inside there. Well, I can tell you... You know what? I'm just going to show you that. You can go over here, but there's not much to do, if I'm not mistaken. So... Yeah, we cannot do a lot here. We're going to need to flame arrow. No spoiling. Spoiling is not allowed in this dungeon. Okay, now now we cannot make that jump, so I'm just going to roll myself downwards. Whee! Thank you. Okay, now let's jump. Because <laughs> zoom tight. Let's climb up the ladder and let's just go to that locked door. That would be so much better. Okay, now. That's going to be our... No wolfles again, and I'm just going to ignore him because I can. Okay, now we are here at this part right over here, and we cannot do a lot here. Uh, maybe on later. Uh, hi there, how are you doing? Please leave me alone. Uh, okay, just wait for him to attack and then just cut off his tail. Thank you very much for dying. Uh, okay, so. Yeah, we're going to need a chunk of ice there. We're not going to do anything up there. Uh, all we could do is get another gay fairy. But first, let's yeah, let's just focus on this one right over here because this contains the compass. Great. Now we have the compass, and we don't have the map because I am stupid and I forgot where the map was. Well, I know where the map was, and I was very close by, and you were probably going to scream right now, like, Dude! You missed the map! You could get the map already, and you missed! Why did you miss? Why are you sucking at this game? Seriously, you suck at this game! Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I do not care. So anyway, if you hold up a bomb, wait, wait, wait for it to flash, take damage for it, you can get another gay fairy that's inside of that crate right over there. Also, you can break this... Uh, yeah, this... Uh, wall right over here to continue to the next area. What air rape? I'm not an air rape. ZP20 girl is mocking me and I should not pay attention to ZP20 girl. I know but I'm doing that anyways. <sighs> that looks like I'm making a fool out of me. Okay, so what do we want to do here? There are chunks of ice here but we can destroy these chunks of ice very easily just by throwing arrows up there. Looks pretty nice. Anyway, you can get a red ruby up there, and we can just destroy these like we did, did at opening this place. Okay. And uh, let's do that. Come on. If I'm not mistaken, there's also a gay fairy in here, so come on. I, I cannot help it that this game has a lot of gay fairies. Tell the player they're called straight fairies. Shut up. Oh, by the way, if you see a good... Yeah, I just got hit. Okay, well, whatever. If you see a uh, s uh, yeah, snow pattern on the wall like that, just use your lens of truth, gaze in it, and you can see... Or there is a stray fairy in there, or I'm just going to mess up the jump, and I... See yeah, I saw the chest right up there, but... Oh, well, who cares? I know it's raining crest all over the place. Um, no, it's raining ice. Okay, well, we got the red ruby, and we just want to jump in here. 
Uh, light, please. Thank you very much. Okay, let's open this one. And this will contain another gay fairy. Ugh. I'm so sick and tired of so many gay fairies around here. And here. And here. Ow! Excuse me for standing too long on one spot. Uh, sp one spot. Anyway, I want to have these red rubies because... I did that on purpose to not bring any rubies from the bank because I just wanted to do that later. So, get that red ruby over there, jump back over here, and go over here, change the lens of truth into bombs because I really am not feeling like being a Goron right now. Yes, you can also blow these up with bombs. Boom. And we will have another chest. Great. And if I'm not mistaken, this one will hold a key. Yay, a small key, and the locked door is right over there, so... whoop de doo Okay, well, was there another gay fairy around here? No, there's no gay fairy around here. And I totally missed get that ruby! <sighs> I wanna have that ruby. How many times do I have to say that I wanna have that ruby? Thank you. Okay, let's continue. Okay, this room is a pain in the ass. Uh, it's a puzzle room, if you didn't see that already. Uh, can I do that in this? Yeah, I can do that in this episode. Uh, first of all, I want to have the Lens of Truth ready. And because if we're going to aim upwards, we can see that there is a hidden gay fairy. I'm just calling them gay fairies. Gay fairies. Come on! You know how ugly... Okay, she's just keep saying stray fairies like crazy, but you know that the big fairy that we are going to help is gay. But anyway, you know, gay fairies. But uh, I'm just focusing on CP20 girl again, and I shouldn't do that. Oh, CP20 girl. Can I tell you a secret? Shut up. Thank you. Okay, you want to jump on this switch that will block that door and open that path right over there. So what do we want to do? We want to turn into normal Link, do a rolling jump, go over here, hit this green switch. Okay, let's go. Hit it. Good. Then we want to knock down the yellow switch. Come on, I can hear the timer again. Okay, then you want to change masks again. Come on, hurry up. There we go. And then we can go through this door. Okay, there are no gay fairies in here, no chests. Okay, we did it. And that brings us to a very annoying part like this. You have to wear a Goron mask, have to stand in the exact... Yeah, you have to press yourself against the wall and then you want to do this rolling thing. And that's going to be a little annoying here because that thing is blocked right over there so we cannot go there so you really want to practice of going on this snow hill without falling off and I didn't fall off great okay punching for some magic it's a kind of magic oh, sorry and that will brings us shut up that will bring us right up here where we can punch these dudes in one hit and I can hear the clock going already so I'm definitely sure that we're not going to make this anyway we have some tiny platforms right over here that's going to be a little annoying right in that chest that you can see down there that's where the map was sorry that I didn't get that one yet I will get that one later but that's where the map is I'm sorry that I didn't tell you that anyway you want to do these precise little small jumping right here and then we will open the chest to get another gay fairy okay uh, well, I see that I have to cut this episode anyway, so I'm just going to fall down, get this gay fairy, because there was another one right over there that I missed. Uh, now there is no gay fairy in here anymore, so we do not have to worry about that. We're just going to open this chest, get the map. Thank you all for watching. Click that thumbs up button if you like this episode. Put a comment if you would like this episode, if you have any questions about it, if you want to just... Drop something about this episode, how sucky my playthrough is right now because I'm missing a lot of stuff. And if you are not a subscriber of me yet, please click on the subscribe button because it's taking a lot of effort to make these videos. So thank you all for watching. This is Zelda Play 20 Girl. Uh, never mind. This is Zelda Play 20 and ZP20 Girl that's mocking me like crazy. That's why I'm making these ridiculous mistakes. I'm just going to sign off right now. Thank you all for watching. Bye!
Wow!